Y'all get ready. Yes, you get ready. Shout out to all my tea sippers out there. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your tea cups ready because you already know this tea is what? Piping hot. All right, you guys. I hope you guys are doing good today. So I want to come out here and talk about the Malika hack situation. So if you guys don't know, for months now, okay, Malika hack, she's refused to disclose the father of her unborn child. So she announced a few months ago that she was pregnant. And so, of course, everybody was like, well, is the father OT Genesis? She refused to name it. She even did an interview with People Magazine. And in that interview, this is what she had to say. I've always wanted to be a mother and it's still a bit surprising, but I'm overjoyed. She tells people I'm a very emotional person anyway, but this is another heightening of emotions. I feel really good about where I am in life and being pregnant now. Hack, who prefers to not disclose the father's identity at this time, first learned she was pregnant after partnering with Clear Blue and monitoring her body for several months with Clear Blue Advanced Digital Ovulation Test and realizing that her period was three days late. The Good American Model then took one of Clear Blue's digital pregnancy tests, which delivered the positive results that Hack described as shocking and unlike any other past experience. Her pregnancy has literally just been one big Clear Blue ad, but... It is what it is. So for months, people have been speculating, is the baby Rob Kardashian's? Is it OT Genesis? Why is she being so quiet about this? Now, they first started dating back in 2017, and then they ended up breaking up in June of this year. So she broke up with him like June 2019. So they were together for a few years. So now, finally, this weekend was Malika's baby shower. It was a beautiful baby shower, well put together, balloons everywhere, the food looked good, honey. Malika Malika, where the hell was my damn invite? Okay, crickets, all right, I got you, sis. So anyways, during her speech at her baby shower, she thanked OT Genesis for basically giving her a baby boy. So she confirmed the father and she confirmed the gender of the child at the same time. Y'all go ahead and check out this video and I'm gonna come back with the rest of my commentary. Um, everyone in this room basically knows my journey and how bad I'm going to be with me. You're going to cry? I love you. <laughs> this is the reason why I didn't want anyone else to speak because I knew I would cry if anyone else said to me what was on their heart. But I also realized that sharing my heart with you guys would make me equally as emotional. Um, I, I have nothing against co ed baby showers, but I will say that the reason why I really wanted to have a shower full of women. It's because it's you women that have helped me get through this pregnancy 100%. Whether you brought me lunch or called me or texted me or I just knew in my heart and in my mind that if I need you go and be there for me, I'm incredibly thankful to Otis Flores for my little boy. And <laughs> All right, so you guys just saw that video. So she has confirmed it for all you guys wondering who her baby daddy is. It is OT Genesis, okay? Which I'm not surprised. I figured it was him from day one anyways. I don't know why she tried to make it a huge secret. But, you know, that's how they do, honey. And anything for attention and anything for a Kardashian storyline. But congratulations to Malika. She seems very, very happy. And she's in a good space. And, you know, even though they're not together and, you know, this is another child being, you know, born into a unwedlocked family either way the child will be well taken care of she has money ot genesis has money and he has another child um he has a little boy who has autism and he's a damn good father to him so i have no doubt that he'll be a great father to their son as well so congrats to them you know i think she's always wanted this maybe this is not the ideal situation but i know that her twin sister khadija you know she has her children she's married and everything else so i think you know malika has been wanting children for a while and it just so happened to you know happen when she least expected it but she'll be okay she has her friends and her family support so once again congratulations to the two of them so let me know your thoughts on this entire situation concerning Malika finally being open and honest about the baby's gender and about who the baby's father is are you guys surprised did you guys always assume it was OT Genesis child let me know your thoughts on everything don't forget to hit the subscribe button make sure you hit the thumbs up and last but not least don't forget to hit the notification bell so that we can be done with the notification squad honey so let's go ahead and get the discussion popping go ahead and leave a comment all right deuces